We have, a, we have a pretty hot spec came in here that we're gonna take a look at today. Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to HBI Auto. We're, we're starting this video off in a 2018 Porsche Cayman. This is a beautiful, beautiful spec. It's one of my favorites that I, I've come across recently. Um, it is a 718 chassis, so two liter turbocharged engine from factory. It is all stock as far as I know, um, but we're gonna go for a drive, pretty much to show off the spec on this one a little bit. A uh, really clean, pretty decent mileage on this one. It's available now at hbiauto.com. If you're going, if you're already curious, you can go ahead and check that link out. Uh, we've reviewed tons of 718s in the past, so I'm not gonna get too into it. Uh, just kind of enjoying the drive a little bit. Now, like I said, this is a two liter turbocharged engine from the factory, uh, which means it's pretty mod friendly in my opinion. Uh, you can do a lot to these cars, including a little tune, intakes, you could do an aftermarket exhaust, lower it, put some different wheels on it. I've seen a lot of these Caymans pop up in the like stance car community and like the show car community. Um, and also I see a lot of them t being turned into GT track cars, uh, just taking the base Caymans and making them kind of look like a, a 981 GT4 or like a 718 GT4, but it's a really good track car nonetheless. I really like them because of how balanced they are. I've, I've screened that into an oblivion by now. Um, this one handles really, really well. Uh, the power on this car isn't anything crazy. I believe it's like mid to low 300s. I don't know off the top of my head, to be honest. It's a really, it's it's decent power for what it is. The chalk and the black is found throughout this entire interior and it's a really clean combination. We've had another Cayman in. Uh, it was also 718. It was probably half a year ago or so now, but it was GT Silver on the exterior, but then it had the chalk, actually it was chalk on the exterior and then it had the chalk with the black interior. PDK transmission, it was so clean. Honestly, that was probably like one of my top five specs that's ever come across our showroom. So this is inside this 2018 Cayman. This one has 43,000 miles on it. Uh, not too bad of a mileage, but also just how clean this interior is. It's actually really, really nice. So this one starting off, you have the classic leather steering wheel from Porsche. I'm into the center console area. Nothing too crazy, nothing out of the way. You do have your sport mode, your traction button. You do have your active aero as well as your automatic start stop button right there. Do you have the chalk with a black interior this is a really nice interior in my opinion just because of how well it complements the exterior paint which you can kind of see right there brand new seats in my opinion like they're really well maintained i really do like the embossed uh porsche logo right there another thing with the caymans that you have tons of good storage back there obviously the engine sits right behind your head as far as layout goes everything's kind of the same but the interior spec i just it looks so clean. I really do love chalk interiors. I don't know what it is, but they've just secretly grown on me. This is the color. This is the exterior. This is a beautiful Miami blue paint job on this Cayman. I really do love Miami blue. It has the biggest spot in my heart. I think it's such a good color. It's so wild, um, but it's also very tame at the same time and really complements the body lines when it's paired with like black accents and also the silver wheels. It really just flows all together for me. Now you've got two 35, 35, 20s in the front and on the back you have two 65, 35, 20. So a little bit of a staggered setup nothing uh too crazy but i really just love how this car looks so clean in my opinion we've had a couple of miami blue cars pop into our inventory here and there uh, and anytime i see one i just i love it again and again i'm really waiting on the day that we get a miami blue gt3 rs in i know one day it'll happen and i'm so excited for that day moving into the back i really do like the clear tails i've preached that in other videos as well uh your active arrow wing right there your center exit exhaust that is going to wrap it up for today's video guys if you're interested in the 2018 came and i left the link in the description below like i said earlier you can check out more photos get in contact with the team about test driving this car or picking it up for yourself really just i love it it's such a fun car it's an easy driver car for someone who's looking to you know step into more of a driver's scene more of a weekend warrior kind of thing uh really just recommend it uh, it's just a fun car to drive and all right and on that note i will see you guys in the next one <laughs>